Sty is a red, painful lump near the edge of your eyelid that may look like a boil or a pimple. Styes are often filled with pus. A sty usually forms on the outside of your eyelid, but sometimes it can form on the inner part of your eyelid. In most cases, a sty will begin to disappear on its own in a couple days. In the meantime, you may be able to relieve the pain or discomfort of a sty by applying a warm washcloth to your eyelids. The following symptoms can help you identifying whether it's sty or something else. Signs and symptoms of a sty include a red lump on your eyelid that is similar to a boil or a pimple, eyelid pain, eyelid swelling or tearing. Now you need to know about another similar medical condition that causes inflammation of the eyelid and it's called chalazion. A chalazion occurs when there's a blockage in one of the small oil glands near the eyelashes. Unlike a sty, a chalazion usually isn't painful and tends to be most prominent on the inner side of the eyelid. Treatment for both conditions is similar. So when you should see a doctor? Well most styes are harmless to your eyes and won't affect your ability to see clearly. Try self-care measures first, such as applying a warm washcloth to your closed eyelid for 5 to 10 minutes several times a day and gently massaging the eyelid. Contact your doctor if the sty doesn't start to improve after 48 hours. If redness and swelling involves the entire eyelid or extends into your cheek or other parts of your face. Now you need to know what causes sty or a chalazion. A sty is caused by an infection of oil glands in the eyelid. The bacterium Staphylococcus is commonly responsible for most of these infections. The following risk factors are associated with sty. You are at increased risk of a sty if you touch your eyes with unwashed hands. Insert your contact lenses without thoroughly disinfecting them or washing your hands first. Leave on eye makeup overnight. Use old or expired cosmetics. Have blepharitis, a chronic inflammation along the edge of the eyelid. Have rosacea, which is a skin condition characterized by facial redness. So that's all in this video. If you find this video informative give a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.